Hello there ladies and gentlemen, people of YouTube, this is Arch Paulie and this is the first episode of my series uh, where I attempt to find what I consider to be my ultimate team. Um, for those of you that have seen the uh, preview and know what this is about, uh, you know, uh, thank you for actually watching. For those of you that don't know what I plan on doing, uh, with such a large amount of uh, players and coins that I have, I want to almost use this as sort of a review sort of um, series um, and trying out maybe trying out players for people trying out teams for people before you buy them you know, I own most of the top players in the game therefore I can try them out for you and give you a good idea on uh, on what they're going to be like and show you a bit of gameplay for them um, so my first squad that I'm going to be making will be one of my own um, so this will be called, we're going to call this first hybrid. Yeah, so this is going to be one of my own doing. After this, if um, if anyone wants to actually give me an idea of what sort of, um, what, te what teams they like me to do, send me an inbox um, with either a, an, a futhead link or just type it out to me, you know, or feel free to send me a message in game, you know, I'm, I'm happy to talk to people. So, uh, I already know what I'm doing for this one, uh, just to mix it up. This is actually a very interesting squad. Primarily, I built this team around the idea of having my two favourite silver uh, players in the game, um, Iago Falk and... This isn't. This isn't the second. God no. Uh, we'll stick Makeda in there, simply for the uh, link up, um, and then we stick in El Shari. So we have Iago Falcon El Shari. So after that, we've got Schlotto, simply because <coughs> he is quite a nice right mid. I didn't know much about him when I first bought him a while back, but he is. A, a rather impressive midfielder. He's not very fast for a winger, which is what a lot of people complain about. But um, still, he does bring quite a lot to the table. Um, obviously, you know, most of these players, when you look at them, you'll realise that they are there primarily for um, sort of, I'd say, sort of chemistry purposes. Um, you know, like Makeda in centre mid. Not many people would play him in centre mid, but I wanted him there simply for you know the extra um, the extra chemistry that he gives uh, Falk and um, El Shari. Uh, goalkeeper, I want to use Helton. Where is he? There's the beast. Freaking insane goalkeeper. Centre back. We use Lucille, and then at left back we use the man that is Cap de Villa. <coughs> um, a lot of people don't know that he actually went to uh, what is it? He went to Benfica. Yeah. Um, one of my requirements for this season is I'm gonna want all the the teams I play with, providing that they have a um, a chemistry of in the in the the light green bar, I will try them. Obviously, I don't. I don't expect me. You know, you don't don't expect me to win all these games. You know, most of these teams I have, would have never have played with, and it's like, it's sort of one of those things. I will never have played with them. I'm simply trying them out for other people. You know, I could play a, with a team. I might. I'll play. I'll try. I'll play three or four games with them and show you the highlights. I might. I could lose all three games, right? But I'll still upload it because that will show you what. I'm not amazing at FIFA, but that will show you what a player of like my ability can do with that team. You know, if you give that team to a better player, they might be able to win all three games. But this is from my perspective as a mediocre FIFA player. This will show you how these teams play. Um, but yeah, so anyway, if we, uh, this is the team I'm going to be using, we've got, uh, just going through them, Helton in goal, Cap de Villa, Lucille, 
uh, David Luiz, Maicon, Shilotto, El Shari, Makeda, Balotelli, Iago Falk, and Crusat. Uh, 98 chemistry, and let's uh, let's get into uh, the highlights of the games I played. So uh, anyway, guys, so here we go for the first game against a um, pretty reasonable. Brazilian squad, I think we can say. You've got Neymar, Hulk, you might be out of formation. But um, anyway, so the game starts off with Iago Falk running down the wing. Now, El Shari comes in with quite a surprising header, to be fair. You know, it's, it's, it's rare that he um, scores headers for me. Um, but anyway, a very good goal. Um, now, uh, Helton comes out with a crazy save here. Um, pretty much, you know, a long stretch. And if I remember rightly, he does make a couple of very nice double saves. This is why I put him in here, because he's very, you know, with him being tall, he's very sort of agile. And, you know, this shows, because he makes these two saves, you know, we go on the break, we we catch them on the break, Balotelli, well, he's he's run the full length of the pitch, he is not going to miss that. Um, then we go into, um, I don't even, I can't even remember, this I think is, see, the guy just keeps spamming skills, it's like freaking Indiana Jones here, because I just stand in, and, you know, El Shari gets the shot off, most of the time, those would probably go in, but, you know, it just didn't this time, Iago Falk, trying to be a bit cheeky, or was that, now is El Shari being a bit cheeky, and, Balotelli just sort of messing up the sort of scissor kick there, but still a nice interception. And there we go, we break again. El Shari chips it into Balotelli and bang, there we go, 3 0. Now, this, this guy was clearly just spamming skills, trying to be a cool kid, but um, what you'll see next is he um, does actually quit. Uh, a really bad free kick with Lucio, and Balotelli was clearly going to be through, and the the guy quit. So, you know, 3-0 first game, quite a nice game. Um, the next one, we play against this sort of a mediocre Prem squad, I'd say. Um, now, I like Mycon as a defender. Well, I did like Mycon, and then this happened. This, my con, is why we can't have nice things. See? That's why you're crying. You're a bad person, my con. Seriously. You'll see after this game just how... What a difference that goal made. You know, and then Johnson, he gets a second goal. Uh, so I'm going to consider it his first. Because my con is a baddie. A bad, bad person. Um, you know, so... Johnson... <laughs> gets his goal. Um, now, this is where I sort of, I want to show the sort of, how de the determination of Chilotto here, really, to win the ball back. And then Balotelli gets the ball and plays a beautiful little lob ball. And El Shari doing what he does best with the immense volley. Um, and that's why, he's, a, he's just a crazy player. That is why he sells for 100k. Also, his five-star weak foot and five-star skill moves, but still. And there, Helton makes the save, and the ref there blows full-time as soon as the ball goes over halfway. I lose this game 2-1, but still, you know, Mykon scored no goal. El Shari scored a crazy goal, so, you know, I don't think it was that bad. You know, it could have been worse. So, this is against a um, sort of Brazilian sort of mixed squad, I guess. A little bit of everything. Um, and I do go 1-0 down here to Wellington. And not a, a nice goal by him, uh, by him, to be fair. But El Shari, as he often does, strikes straight back. He spams skill moves like a mofo. Gets the ball back. And bang. A lovely little lobbed ball over the keeper. And that's... <laughs> what more can you ask for? I mean, yeah, he did cost 100k. So you could probably ask for quite a bit more. But... Still, you know, a bit of skills there by Elsha. You know, wins the throw-in. And, you know, this is what I play for, really. Because you skill it with Elshari on this team. You then cut inside, free, yeah, free kick. And cometh the hour, cometh the man. 
Cap de Villa can get the fuck off this ball because Iago Falk steps up and bang. His stats are not great. He is not some hidden gem of free kicks, but still he bangs them in for fun. You know, and unfortunately I didn't get more free kicks during these games, but you know, uh, there we go. Another interception. We break again. No. Yeah, we tried to break the first time. There we go. Captavia cuts across from the left. Through to El Shari. He has pace to burn. You know, cuts in on his weak foot. And bang. Weak, that's five star weak foot for you, ladies and gentlemen. And we're 3-1 up now. And <coughs> unfortunately, the defence does then decide to cock up again. And allows Wellington to get another goal. Which was depressing, but still, um, the game did finish 3-2. Uh, so, um, but yeah. So, anyway guys, please rate, comment and subscribe on this video. Tell me what you think, and give me some ideas for the next video. Uh, thanks guys, and peace out.